I'm never letting go. <laughs> this is wonderful. Just now. What are you talking about? It's lovely. It's the best. Hugging is very underrated, and I think we're going to realize that because so many people have not been able to hug this year. Yeah. One, two, three. Sisters. Friendships. That was really close. One, One two, two, three. three women. One, two, three. two, three. Support. Power. One, One, two, three. Business. Society. Ooh, we're getting closer. <sighs> Society and business. One, One two, two, three. Hard money. work. One, One two, two, three. Jobs. One, two, three, retirements. And that's where our head's at. I'm <laughs> ready to retire. She's ready to focus. <laughs> Is that a successful my mail? <laughs> Mama, what is this, drama school? <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to hug you because okay, we haven't gotten a, a ton of hugs. Yes. Oh, hug me so Any for a whole minute. minute. Awesome. Which side do you want? Which side do you want? Oh, oh, we'll get it. We'll get it. Get we go. go. We're going to spider there for go. one minute. Oh, yeah, that's better. so many times on set when I just come up and put my head on your chest and it's so nice. It's so nice. Hugging is so underrated. It is. We get oxytocin after 20 seconds. Did you ever spider like this on the swings? No. No? <laughs> when you like put someone on your lap and then you go back, I mean I'm not gonna like rock on you right now because it'd be super weird but. But it's what they want. If we were, <laughs> if we were on a swing. I'm never letting go. <laughs> <laughs> this is wonderful. What are you talking about? It's lovely. It's the best. Hugging is very underrated, and I think we're going to realize that because so many people have not been able to hug this year. Yeah. Or last year. And now yeah. they're even afraid too, because you can't like touch people. No, you don't yeah. know who's gross and no. who's not. And even if you hug someone, it's not going to. It's going to be like a. Oh, we don't know. Are we allowed to? Uh, Everything's hesitant. Physical contact is very hesitant Physical right now. contact I love, but I will say I'm not, and this is, might be controversial, but I'm not, oh, I'm, I'm okay that handshakes have like been retired because I just feel like, you know, the handshakes were invented from like, thank you baby, from like us being in a field together, part of different groups where like I'd put my hand out, I think I'm saying this right, to show you I didn't have a weapon. Ah, okay. But like at this point, pretty sure you don't have a weapon. Yeah. You don't need to. You know, shake I, over that, and sometimes I don't mind a handshake. Do you know what I don't like is handshake, handshake, and it happens less here, more in the UK. But handshake, handshake, kiss on both cheeks because I'm the woman. So like, don't put your face in my face. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. want to kiss. I don't want to hug. I don't want handshake, handshake, hug. That's also weird. Yeah. Like if we're in a business setting and you're Be shaking consistent. everyone's hand, let's Continuity just all shake errors. hands. Yeah. And I also <laughs> actually, this is a funny thing because European, do, the European people do like we'll do the double kiss and. I don't need it. <laughs> <laughs> and sometimes I have a hard time saying that at home. And I don't need it. I don't need to kiss a stranger. Mm -hmm. I, your whole cheek. And some people do like cheek, cheek. But some people kind of put their lips on your cheek. And I'm like, now I think about it, I think, no. Oh, we just did that. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> this is also what Kirby teaches me is like, you've got to let people know how you want to greet them. Yes, yes. So I'll greet people if I don't want a handshake like this. Hi, I'm Kristen, nice to meet you. Yeah. And Kirby will be like. <laughs> be like, hello. Yeah, hi. <laughs> Mine's gonna be better than yours. Mine's gonna be the best. You're gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> Kristen, you have found a hairstyle that suits you completely, and girl, I am still searching. Girl, I am still searching. But I just keep trying different ones out. But that is literally one of the things I love so much about you because whenever you ha you try a new style, I'm always like, 
damn, she nailed that one too. <laughs> and sincerely, this right here is the reason that I went dark. The reason that I stopped being a blonde, I saw Kirby go blonde, and it was when it was short. It was like a couple months ago during the Cruella press tour, and I was like, that's a wrap, I guess. No one else needs to try. It's like a John Hughes movie. Don't remake it. It's been done perfectly, and I love it so, I mean, it's just like, oh, I just love it so much. Okay, Kirby, your confidence, good character, and the way you carry yourself has a ripple effect on those around you that I don't think you realize. Oh. KB, you are one of the most generous people I have ever met. I hope to always show people they are loved in the way that you do. I told you we're gonna cry. <clears throat> Thank you, Kirby. You are one of the best improvisers I have ever seen, and that's saying a lot since I live with one. <laughs> <clears throat> and you make my life better. Well, basically, I want to paraphrase it to Kristen saying that I'm funnier than Dax. I was being genuine because it is astounding what you do on a live stage. Oh my god, thanks, Kristen. <sighs> she did it better than me. No, no. Just like her hairstyle, <laughs> she just knows what works. <laughs> <laughs>I think especially right now, a lot of compliments can feel transactional because it does. it's always like, yes girl, you slayed. And it's like, most of them are digital and people don't know you. But when someone knows you and they can really speak to the impact that, you're, that you have on them, I think that's kind of the beautiful thing about friendship is that you don't actually fully know how much you mean to someone else. Like, you, you're only being you and you don't know how they're receiving you and how much you can learn and grow from them. I think that it made me feel really good to hear those from you also because I have learned such a profound amount from you about character and about how to walk through life. And I say that broadly because there's so many different facets to what I've learned from you. How to carry myself, how to react to other people, how to react to myself. I hold you in such high regard as one of like my trusted circle that if I don't, if I don't see you every day but I know I could call you and at any given moment and that you would help me with advice. The fact that there are things that I give to you just makes me feel like oddly that I love that it's a little more transactional because I couldn't quantify how much that you have given to me and if I've given you a modicum of that, it makes me very happy. Oh, you have 100%. Thank you, Glamour. Thanks, Glamour, for letting us do the friendship test. Yeah, thanks for making us cry today. <laughs> thanks for making me cry. Thanks for making me cry. Love Inside, you. you know I don't cry. I know. <laughs>